So let me ask you this, uh, Dr. Wise. And, uh, what, what kind of evidence do we have of dinosaurs and humans concurrently, at the same time, cohabiting Earth? As a paleontologist, having looked at a lot of that, those claims, and mm -hmm. there's thousands of claims out there that humans and dinosaurs live together and there's evidence of it, my contention is, as a paleontologist, that there's none of that that's conclusive enough to convince me that human and dinosaur remains are found in the same sediments. Okay. Simply not. Not. So then, uh, Kurt, what do we do with the 1930s? What was it? Paluxy River, Texas. They, the, the claim was that side by side you had a dinosaur print and a human print. What, what, what about that story? One of many claims that humans and dinosaur remains are found in the same sediments, but uh, subsequent studies indicated, as far as I'm concerned, there's definitely dinosaur prints mm -hmm. there, but I see no definite evidence of human prints in those, anywhere in the, in the Paluxy River Just area. Just not there, period. It's not no. there. So, is there evidence of a cohabiting of this planet at the same time? No. Of I humans and dinosaurs? I would say no physical evidence. No physical no. evidence. There's no physical evidence for it. There's no physical evidence for it. There's no physical evidence for it. So, is there evidence of a cohabiting of this planet at the same time? No. Of I humans and dinosaurs? I would say no physical evidence. No physical no. evidence? No. Well, what kind of evidence is there then? There's no physical evidence for it, but there is scriptural evidence mm -hmm. that would suggest that that's in fact the case. Mm -hmm. There is scriptural evidence. Mm -hmm. Scriptural evidence. Mm -hmm. Scriptural evidence. There is scriptural evidence. Seven years of college down the drain.